Hi everyone, today we are going to discuss about East West Institute of Technology located in Magdi Road, Bangalore. It established in 2001 having the affiliation with BTU. Approved from the AICTE having the accreditation of NAC B++ grade NBA for more branches. When it comes to the course offered in the East West institution, the undergraduate programs are Computer Science, IS, EC, Mechanical, Civil, AML, AA and Data Science, IoT and Cyber Security. When it comes to the post-graduation, MTech in a few CS branches and meanwhile it having the MBA course. When it comes to the campus, it having the 20 acre green campus, smart classrooms, modern lab, library, it having the separate boys and girls hostel, auditorium, gym, cafeteria, medical center. Meanwhile, it having the different sports facility, basketball, football, volleyball, table tennis and cricket ground. When it comes to the transportation, it having the multiple buses for different routes. When it comes to the next segment placement, it having the placement rate 70 to 80%. The top recruiters for East West institution Infosys, TCS, Wipro, Cognizant, Amazon, IBM, Capgemini, Bosch, Mercedes, Oracle. So when it comes to the IS package, in the last year, they reached 26.65 lakh per year. When it comes to the average package, 3.5 to 6 lakhs per annum, especially for IT branches student. Now we are going to discuss about the admission process for UG entry means B course through KCET, Comet K or management quota, you can get the admission. For eligibility, you should have 45% in the PCM. For 40% if you belong to the SC, ST and OBC category. For PG courses, you need to either represent in the PGCET, KMAT for MBA, MCA courses, GATE and PGCET for MTech courses. And meanwhile, you can join the engineering if you completed the diploma as a lateral entry. When it comes to the fee structure, if you are joining through the KCET, the fees may vary from 65,000 to 1 lakh 30,000. When it comes to the comment K or management quota, the comment K fees will be the comment K fee structure. It may vary from 1 lakh 50,000 to 3 lakhs if you are joining through the management depending on the course or if you are going for the IT branches the fee structure will be more if you are going for the non IT branches the fee structure will be less if you want more detail and precise price you can visit the college when it comes to the PG courses according to the government fees they will take and according to the management fees they will collect when it comes to the KCET cutoff in the last year for CS general merit branches, it closed in between the 45 to 52,000 in the round one. When it comes to the AI and data science, around 61 to 68,000 from the round one and round two. When it comes to the AC branch, it is 77 to 89,000. When it comes to the civil, it comes to 1,58 to 1,70,000. When it comes to the mechanical, it is very similar to the civil ranking. So if you are selecting the competitive branch like CS, A, Data Science, you need to require KCT ranks under 60,000 to get the seat in the East West institution. If you want to get the admission for EC, civil and mechanical, so if you have the higher ranking also, you can opt for the CET. If you not get this ranking less than 60,000, it's highly difficult to get the IT branches. So if you are interested for non-IT branches, you can easily get the seat in the CET only. Now we're going to discuss very important segment why to join East Bay Institute of Technology. Because it is a NBA and NAC accredited BTO affiliated programs, it having the diverse courses in trending tech domains strong placement network in the IT and core sector, affordable with KCET seat cost lower than many private colleges, full campus amenities and supportive scholarship schemes, it having the good research and PhD opportunity in this college. 
when it come to the next uh, factor why not to join uh, east west institute of technology it located on magdi road commit may be challenging lower brand recall compared to the top tier colleges placements are modest in branches like civil mechanical or non it branches when it come to the campus culture events and uh, foreign uh, collaborations are moderate research type are limited compared to the premium institution so these are the reasons you need to think twice before joining the east west institute of technology when it come to the conclusion at the end of the day every college has its own strength and limitation east west institute of technology may not be among the top tier institutions in bangalore but it offers a peaceful learning environment experienced faculty and growing placement opportunity especially in trending field like aml and data science for students entering through kcet or common k it's definitely a college worth considering if you are looking for value for money education but remember no matter which college you choose your dedication curiosity and consistency will shape your success more than anything else if this video help you understand east west institute of technology better don't forget to like share and subscribe to innovative feature where we simplify college choices and guide you to make right academic decision whether you are exploring colleges confused about cut off or just need honest insights we have got your back stay tuned stay curious and let's build your future one step at a time thank you